Hi, everyone. I just want to go over a few things for the test. So this is just like a review. Uh, this first one is over mitosis. Um, and mitosis is cell division. And that, you know, has a definition here that it's a process where a eukaryotic cell doubles its chromosomes and then divides into two cells that are copies of that original cell. Uh, it has two cells that are made when an organism like you grows or repairs damaged tissue like a cut. So in this, um, they have this orange chromosome and then this blue one, and those are identical, and then they're going to split to opposite sides of the cell. Um, and eventually we will have two cells. We have the orange and the blue here. Um, they're identical, but, you know, to show the picture, they did them in different colors. So the four phases of mitosis are prophase, metaphase, anaphase, and telophase. Um, those are going to be your four phases of mitosis. Now, mitosis is part of the cell cycle, and that's what this image is here. Um, with the cell cycle, we have the first phase, which is G1, then S, then G2. And then within that, we have mitosis. Um, and at the end of mitosis, we have cytokinesis, which is when the cell actually splits apart. Uh, so the big things to remember for this are those four phases of mitosis, prophase, metaphase, anaphase, and telophase. At the end, we have cytokinesis, which is actually when the cell splits apart, like these two here, and that it produces two identical cells. Um, this is a process for, you know, if you have cells that are damaged in your body to replace those cells or then for you to grow. Um, if you guys can imagine, everybody started out as one cell, and now um, our bodies are made of trillions of cells. So that is the process of growth is through mitosis. Um, next, we're going to go over meiosis. So um, we have our, this one actually has both of them on here, mitosis and meiosis. And I like this chart here. Um, there was a lesson for you guys to compare them. Um, so just kind of to go over it. Uh, with mitosis, it's going to occur in body cells. And then meiosis occurs in gametes. And gametes are sex cells. So there would be sperm or egg cells. Uh, when we look at crossing over, that only happens in meiosis. And that's going to happen in prophase one of meiosis. And we have our diagram down here. So I don't think I can, I don't know if I can highlight that. But that's going to be uh, prophase one is when uh, crossing over is going to occur. And then how many times does the cell divide? Uh, with mitosis, the cell only divides once. With meiosis, it divides two times. And because it does divide two times, that's when we get those four daughter cells. With meiosis, where mitosis, there are only two. Um, and the daughter cells being identical, we say yes for mitosis and then um, no for meiosis. And that's why we see so many differences um, within populations. So if you guys can imagine your siblings, you don't look exactly like them. And it's because of the process um, of meiosis with crossing over um, and many other things. But those cells are not identical. With mitosis, they are identical, and that's a good thing. Um, if you get hurt, you want the new cells in your body to look just like the old ones. And then are the daughter cells haploid or diploid? So diploid, if you guys see that, di, that means two, and that's where we get that two in. We have two sets of chromosomes. You guys have one set from your mom and the other from your dad. Um, and then haploid, if you can imagine that, I think that HA, like half, there's half the number. It's the only one set. And then what kind of reproduction? Uh, this is asexual uh, for mitosis and then sexual for meiosis. Um, <clears throat> excuse me. So when we look at those phases of meiosis, they're the exact same as the phases of mitosis. Uh, they just have a one after them. So we have interphase, which would be that G1, S, and G2. And then we go into prophase one. Metaphase 1, anaphase 1, telophase 1. And then we do the same thing again, but out of 2. So prophase 2, metaphase 2, anaphase 2, and telophase 2. And then finally, cytokinesis. Um, so hopefully this helps. Um, if you need anything, please let me know, and good luck on the test. Bye, guys.